Hey friends, Beck here from Power Creative Media. Today we're talking about the secret to being consistent on social media. This is the number one thing that people say that they have trouble with, even though there are about seven things that are kind of underlying around this issue. Um, the biggest thing that people say is they want to be more consistent. I'm sure if you're watching this, you want to be more consistent on social media. And that means one of two things, either you have to post the stuff, you have to do it, or someone else has to. But somebody has to be posting or something has to be posting every single day um, for you to be consistent on social media. Listen, daily is my whole thing, okay? I'm not saying that every business needs to post daily. I'm sure if you posted three times a week, that would be quite sufficient. Maybe you're not even doing that. I like to just go with daily. It's a good little marketing thing and it makes um, it makes things really simple. And it's a good thing to aim for, for something to go out every single day for your audience so they can see your face, so they can hear your voice every single day. So um, what is the secret to this consistency? So um, like I said, I choose daily. Um, so that's what I'm gonna be talking about in this video. But one of the things that I think really stops us is getting things perfect, right? So it took me a long time to start posting daily, like a long, long time, because I was so worried about putting out something that wasn't um, wasn't going to be consistent. You know, if I was going to do it, then I wanted to do it properly, you know? Um, and then I wanted to make sure that I had a whole system set up so that it would work without me or, you know, with minimal input. Um, and I wanted to put good stuff out every day, obviously. Um, but one of the things that I've learned uh, in the last couple of years is that um, you, you, you know, habits get built slowly. You're not going to be perfect. The, the failure is a part of building the habit. And so um, my advice is to create some, some type of system that you can use every day. And the system might be you posting a selfie every day just to get something out there every single day and maybe that would last for five or six days and then you would go okay cool i've been doing a selfie every day now i'm going to do a, a question every day whatever the thing is the thing that helps me is to do it at the same time every day so i start my day at um, my work day at about eight o'clock most days um, i have a call at 9 30 every morning and so between 8 and 9.30, I create content. I make sure that I get all my stuff done. Um, that's, I, I make sure it's all shared where it needs to be shared. I have a team doing this with me, but I am responsible for it. And so I make sure that everything is getting done still right now. At some point, they will be able to just do everything without me. They're not up to that yet. It's totally cool. I make sure I'm responsible for everything that goes out. Um, and I'll probably talk more about that in another video. But your thing might be just to wake up and post a question. You know, maybe you've written out, um, I wish I could show you this thing I've got on my desk. It's a calendar of it, every day is a different topic. And those are my live video topics that I, I do. Uh, they might not be live. Those are my video topics that I do. Um, and I also have one for the posts that I write every day too. So I plan them out once a month so they're all there. The worst thing is waking up in the morning and sitting down at your desk and going, okay, what should I talk about today? Oh, the worst. It never happens. I won't ever record a video if I have to do that. I have to have all the topics written out so that I can just look at the topic, write three bullet points, and then I'm good to go to talk about the thing. So um, hopefully that is valuable because, because probably it's one of those things that's been stopping you. And probably um, you would do a lot better if you just implemented a daily habit. Um, a lot, I, I talk a lot about habits in my content and um, there's probably a whole bunch of videos if you search for habits on my page or something like that. Um, but building a daily habit is just a really good habit to get into. Uh, a daily habit of content. You could do a daily habit of anything. You probably want to have other habits daily, but you haven't been doing those. So just incorporate content into those. And as I said, it can be as simple as you want. It could just be, um, if you don't log in currently on social media, then log in every day for five minutes or something like that. Most of us don't have that problem. 
Um, but I, the reason that I say that you should post at the same time every day is because that's when the habit comes in. It's not like, oh, it's 4 p.m. and I've been faffing around and I'm just going to like, now I'm going to post. No, like I do mine in the morning. I would do yours whenever you are the most productive slash um, when your audience is online. If you're really productive at 1 a.m., not a great time to post. Schedule it or something until the morning of the next day or something like that. Um, the other thing I wanted to say about this is that you don't need to, I really want to emphasize that you don't need to create a whole shebang of things. If you're just getting started, don't you don't need to create a, an entire crazy whole system with multiple pieces, podcasts, videos, blog posts, emails, social media posts, scheduling, um, like graphics and infograph. Like that's an overkill for you right now. If you're, you know, it might be an overkill for you right now. You have to judge where you're at on this um, spectrum. Uh, if you do have a lot of content and you need a better way for it to go out more regularly, that's a different conversation and you should have a call with me because I can help. So book a call with me. It's probably somewhere around this video or um, on our website, powercreativemedia.com. Um, if you are just starting out, literally just do a video or literally just do a post once a day and start with that and make sure it goes out every day because you don't want to try to do an overkill because it'll be too much for you and you'll give up. Um, so just keep it really small. One of the things that helped me to build this system was every day, um, even if even it doesn't matter what the thing was on my list, I had to do it to build up my um, ability to trust myself and trust my own word that I would get the things done that I said. So in the beginning, it was um, go outside. That was the only thing on my to-do list. Now, of course, I have a secondary to-do list, which is like nice to-dos, but this like the very top thing in my book, no notebook every morning must get done. It must get done. Whether I want to, whether I don't want to is irrelevant. I have to do the thing. So whatever I put in there, that has to get done. Then I have a secondary list that if I can get through it, great. I work through that. But usually once I've done that first thing, um, once that first thing is complete, that gives me like a sense of hell yeah, I've done the thing or things that are on my main list. Now, to, as of today, well not as of today, but today I have um, multiple things. I'm looking at it on my wall. Record a video every day, schedule an email every day, write a story post every day, um, do my list. There's a list I have of um, how I'm going to show up today and things like that and to go outside. And those are my things. And I think I'm going to add like do a reel or a TikTok as well. One of those every day, just because I'm doing pretty well at this list now. But don't add more stuff at the beginning. Otherwise, you're just going to get overwhelmed. So um, the secret that I would say for social media to be to being more consistent on social media is to keep it really simple and build a really small habit. I would build a habit. It doesn't actually matter if it's related to social media at the beginning. It could just be going outside, eat breakfast or um, do yoga or literally just make your bed or something that is you can cross off every day that that's going to get done every day. There's probably tons of things you already do every day um, that you want to, maybe you want to put one of those on there. But um, that's an important thing because then it tells your brain that you are the type of person who does the things that you say you're going to do and then your other behaviors follow after that thinking. So um, hopefully that makes sense. It's not too woo. Um, and like I said, when you have got a good role going, do add, then add something else. Don't try to do 20 things a day from day one. It will be a huge disaster. Trust me, I've tried that 100 times. It doesn't work. Um, you have to start with something small and just build it up as you go. And eventually you will have a really solid social media practice. You'll be able to build more of a system now my system um, is, listen, it's not perfect. No one's system is ever perfect. But now I mostly just show up and record my video and submit it into my existing form that I've got. And my team knows what to do with it and it goes where it needs to go. I still check it to make sure it goes out there or sometimes, you know, how it is, the, the, the verification expired or some weird issue or there's still things I need to fix. But... Most times I can just turn up, record the video, push submit, and I'm done with that for the day. Um, 
obviously there are, I want to be clear, there are 7 million other things that I have to do during the day. But for content, most times um, I just, uh, well, I do the email now too. Um, but for consistent content, I make sure that there's a video that goes out every day. It's turned into a blog post. It's turned into an email, which I then log in and send still, but that won't always be the case. Um, and it is turned and it's got a YouTube thumbnail and it, everybody knows where everything goes, so it goes. And for the most part, that's pretty great. Um, so if you want more help, uh, it's just got a bit rambly. If you want more help uh, with your social media, figuring out a system, building um, habits, or you just don't want to deal with it at all, um, my team can help. We can, we can take over your content so that you don't need to do it at all. We can take your existing videos um, and turn those, or podcasts or books, and turn them into loads of pieces of micro content um, and or we can show you how to build a really really awesome system similar to ours um, inside of ClickUp probably uh, if you really want somewhere else we can look at that too but ours is in ClickUp we can do all of these things for you so reach out uh, my, my email is beck at powercreative.me and our website is powercreativemedia.com so Hopefully that's helpful and I will see you in the next video.